Hey, this will be a video chart on ticker symbol PMCM. We will take a look at the daily time frame. Done this one uh, at least one time, maybe two. I uh, can't remember. But anyways, been getting quite a few requests on it. So I want to get the chart updated so everybody's got an idea of what's going on from the technical perspective. So uh, I think the last time I did it was sometime around one of these big moves here. And at that point, the, the key level that you wanted to see the price remain above was this purple line, which is the 50-day simple moving average. Very important uh, moving average in the world of technical analysis and therefore uh, important level of support. And you can see here, temporary did uh, drop below it, uh, but the nice strong sign there was that it only stayed below it for two days and it didn't separate in terms of you know continuing to fall down, went sideways, and then got right back above it. So that's a nice little uh, victory in and of itself. Sure, you'd like to see it stay up here, but it was nice to see it get up back above uh, the 50-day. And then you can see here these two days in a row uh, pulled back and back tested it, and then it held as support uh, exactly like you would want to see it. And you can see now it has since bounced upwards. So yesterday was a, a very nice way to start the week. Big volume, big price reaction. Uh, so the uh, majority of people are asking now, you know, is this over? Was this just a one-day pop? And uh, I would say no right now. And the reason I would say no is because the price is still holding up uh, the way you would want to see it. And the way you would want to see it, how, uh, how am I uh, defining that? Well, that's just simply the price has and is remaining above this two or excuse me 50 day something we were an average now if the price were to close below this then I would say you know what this day was just a one day wonder things over but because we're still above it you know I think think there's uh, could still be some uh, momentum here behind it you know it was just a consolidation day you can see here pullback volume was much less than the breakout day and as any volume analysis textbook will tell you that's uh, you know the sort of action you want to see for that so a uh, quick answer no I don't think this was a one day wonder there's still hope left for it now maybe tomorrow it'll close collapse through here or maybe it'll start to head back upwards but the point being uh, for me uh, as long as it remains above this purple line then there is still a chance that you know it can put in some you know higher high so uh, 0.0035 which is a 50 day simple moving average is definitely the key level of support now in terms of resistance levels the key one that's sticking out to me is uh, going all the way back to uh, June 11th here which was a high of 0081 so this will be the key level of resistance that I would like to see broken, but more importantly, closed above. Yesterday it did break it, but you can see by the closing bell, wasn't able to close above it. So 0.008, that's, uh, or 881 if you want to call it, uh, is the key level of resistance. Next level of resistance after that is not until way up here uh, over a penny at 0.012. So lots of potential to run, uh, but you know this 0.0081 is going to be the key level of resistance. 0.0035, the 50-day simple moving average, is going to be the key level of support. So these are definitely the two uh, important areas to watch going forward, and uh, you know the, the chart's going to kind of uh, be dictated by how the price reacts around either of these levels. So if there are any other questions on the chart, please let me know. If not, I'd encourage you to sign up for a free newsletter up there. When you do that, you'll receive an ebook. And if you enjoyed the video and want to learn more about charting and how to use it in your strategy as a trader, I'd encourage you to click below and look at our educational course. Over eight and a half hours of video and teaching has been getting great third-party reviews. So I'd encourage you to make an investment in your education as a trader and check it out. One more time, this was PMCM. Thanks for listening.